Yeah, if we hit continue. Game clear. This proves that you've beaten the game. Nice work. You now access the chapter selection menu from the main menu. No. Congratulations, you beat the game. This tale is now drawn to a close. If you like, you can revisit any part of the story. Just select a day from the chapter selection menu. All your items, pins, and other stats will be carried over. You can skip past cutscenes you've already seen by pressing the skip button. Delve into each chapter to unlock secret reports penned by, well... It's okay. Uh, you'll have to see for yourself! The reports flesh out the backstory for each day, and we hope answer some of your lingering questions. Collect all the reports for one last surprise. I won't spoil it for you. Beating the game has also unlocked a side story, another day. Join the cast's alter egos in a zany romp through an alternate Shibuya. I guess it's more like a funny episode then, I guess? Okay, it's all you now. Pick a chapter, live a little. You can access the chapter selection menu via the main menu. That's the only way out of this room, got it? Good, tutorial box out. Yeah. So did I have to go back to the main menu? Uh, no, just go back. Right there, chapters. Chapters, chapters. Right there. Ah. Another day, this ends... This day ends with you. <laughs> On a certain day at a certain time in a different world, this like totally really happens. What oh boy. To view the day's report. So it says, complete the following to view this day's report. Um, so I have to collect the report for beat on day seven, track down and eliminate all this chapter's pig noise symbols, get the girls' uniforms with sweater. The stage is as dark as ever. Only the ultimate enemy at the top of Pork City. So I guess I have to complete these to unlock this? Is that how that works? I don't know. Can you just click the question mark? No? Huh. Yeah, those are all the days on the right there, right? And I guess the stars represent, like, the things you've completed for each of those days. Huh. Secret Day X. Unless I just click on that. I think that's something different. I think that was in the original game. Huh. What about this one? I think that's what you unlock for getting all the reports. Huh. So what happens yeah. when I click that? Tell you're about to experience depicts a world entirely separate from that of the main story. Same station, same crowds too, same noises, same buildings zigzagging across the sky. Man, life is sweet. Ahem, dear lord, please let today be even sweeter than yesterday. Thanks, peace. There. Now today's totally gonna kick ass. Or, or is it? Oh no. I feel my inner emo stirring. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Must fight emo urges. Yeah. You said this game came out in 2007? Yes, that sounds right. That was that, like, the... Peak, peak of the emo. Yeah. Wait, I've got it. I just need to focus on the light of my life. My beacon of hope. Yes, that'll pull me right out of this funk. Why? Because that light is... A trick of fate? A microcosm of my world? The meaning of life? It's my purpose. Kin Pin Slammer is my purpose. I will be the greatest slammer that ever lived. Quick, Tomoko, I must hurry! They're holding a slam off there this very day! Oh? Yup. 
Okay, this is the extra chapter then that they added. Ends when you want it to end. I see. Go where you want, do what you like, keep it real. When you're ready to bail, just go to the chapter selection menu and jump to another chapter. That was very sandboxy, in other words. Yep. Does that mean you could also pick which partner you're using? It's a shiki right now. It's just like forced shiki. I don't see a way to change it. Go back. Uh, items? Ah, right there at the top. Change it to Joshua. Yeah. There we go. Yeah. Can we choose the difficulty now? Or, I mean, we could always choose it, but could we choose the even higher one now? No. Okay. Yeah. Like a bolt from the blue, it's time for a tin pin lesson for me to you. I see. Just tells you how to play tin pin slammer. We know how to do that. Now you're ready to slam with the best. Perhaps another day you may even face me. Uh who is this guy? Yeah. yeah. Oh, you still have this setup. That's Watch fine. How's my aim? Get how blast oh. attack works. <laughs> Predictable. There you go. That's how it's done. Yeah, level up the lightning. Hey, got time to play me in Tin Pin? Tin Pin? Sorry, not right now. I have to get over to Molko. Oh? The Slam Off, aren't you going? Thought all the boys were. Oh, I'm going. I just figured I'd warm up first. Gotcha, hmm. Oh, what the hey, one round. <laughs> Big time. Sweet, get ready. Yeah, Tin Pin Slam. <laughs> it's alright. Yeah, get her. It's a... I think you click on it and then... Or do you swipe it? Can't remember. Oh, L. You hold L and then you slash over it. There you go. She just bounced her pin off. Hey, no fair. What's not fair? Since when are you so good? Since when are you so bad? 
Just my dreams of becoming the champ. The price of sucking, I'm afraid. I know. Why don't you become the champion? Um, okay. I mean, that was the plan. Then after he gives you the prize, shake my hand. Promise? After who gives me the prize? Oh, yeah. <laughs> there you go. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Thank you. I guess you could like battle everybody in Tin Pen. Seems like it. That is humorous. Yep. Good work, Neku. Good work, Neku. Oh yeah, that's right. I can pick up enemy with Joshua's ability. I thought it was... Uh. I don't remember how to use skill three. Rest in peace. That was a nice distraction. What does leveling up your monkey do? Hmm? What does leveling up your monkey pin do? Did it give it an extra use? I think it gave it extra uses. It might have. Can your lightning bolt evolve? Will not evolve. Okay. It was very helpful in that last match. It's, like, specifically tailored for beating the final boss. Oh uh, yeah, you gotta fix up your press nothing deck. Press nothing deck. Yeah, your press empty space deck. I think that one was decent, or that was rapidly tap, right? You were having an issue where there was a difference between rapidly tap and tap. Yes. And that was causing problems. I mean, you could add the lightning to this. It, it's also just a regular tap, right? It's true, you're right. But you have to actually take it out of the deck, unfortunately. It's dumb. We have our cool ghost. Yeah, there's a cool ghost. Does that evolve again? No. A lot of, okay, so that's its max level. And then you add all the food. If you want to do the food, or if you want to do... So that one's also tapped, so you had the bat. So yeah, you could either add a heal to this, or you could add one more tap for damage. All right. Yeah. All right. Chain four. Have 
fun, Negu. Yeah. I wasn't expecting it to actually be an elephant. Can I pick up the elephant? No, but I can fire my laser at him. Yeah. Yep. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, or, oh, okay, right. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, oh. what are you saying? The elephant is very strong. <laughs> oh, the other thing that was also suspicious to me was how, like, Neku and Joshua had, like, an extra special, like, you know, final minigame thing, if you will. Minigame thing? Yeah, I know how it, like, went up to 200% sync and everything. Oh, no, that's because of how I equipped Joshua. Oh, okay. I set him up for, like, a sync build. I see. Yep. But yeah, he also has angels too that just come down. Yup. Yeah, when he's in his Jesus mode. Do you need a break? We up for this? I remember in the original game, Joshua could actually switch back and forth between being in his Jesus mode and his camera mode. Huh. Three. Uh, one, two, three. 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 Work for you. What do you say? Go away. How's my aim? <laughs> Predictable. 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 Watch yourself. Go away. Actually, surprised at how tough this elephant fight is. Frogs are annoying. Right? How's my aim? I beat an ultimate dragon with this move. And Frog is just like, nope. Yep, yeah, he's dotted. Oh my god, Frog, die. Have the freaking composer and the guy that beat the conductor. Well, I guess he wasn't the conductor. Just some other random reaper. Can't beat a stupid frog. One, two, three. One, two, three. 
One, two, three. Uh, one, two, three. One, two, three. Uh, what are you using? Right. Could you, oh. Neku? Oh no. Don't make this worse for yourself. See ya. There! Look! That'll do. Good work. Just die. Good work, Neku. Good work, Nicky. One, two, three. One, two, three. Uh, 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 There we go. this was for yourself. How's my aim? You are done. How's my aim? That'll do. Got him. How's my aim? Oh. There we go. That was nothing. Alright, two more elephants. Three. One, two, three. 
One, two, three. Uh, one, two, three. That should do it. Beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Yep. Maxed out your ghost. There we go. Oh, and your lightning. Beautiful. <laughs> Excellent. Yep. Oh. I would dare say that was a good, like, the final hoorah. Good, yeah, just goof around thing. Yeah. But, yeah, guess we'll call it here. Yes. So, yeah, fantastic game. I love it. it I'm really glad good. I got to share it with you. And now yeah. we can play the next one. Exactly. Yeah. So, yeah, everyone that joined us through this adventure, thank you for coming along for the ride. Uh, look forward to Neo The World Ends With You, where hopefully Makoto will come back. And, uh, yeah. That was good. Yeah, look forward to more hot stuff. Hot stuff. Hot stuff. <laughs> this has been Glint Gamers. I'm Ryan, this is Kayla, and see you next time. GG, everybody. GG.